Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you're new, welcome and don't forget to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, welcome back. So as you can see in the title, the name of this video is called Random Numbers Pick My Wash Day Routine or Numbers Pick My Natural Hair Products. So this challenge is very new to the natural hair community. As a matter of fact, there's only three other videos, if I'm not mistaken, that have a video like this. So this challenge started in the whole beauty makeup world. So there were challenges such as random numbers pick my palette or random numbers pick my eyeshadows or random numbers pick my lipsticks or whatever it may be. So this was the challenge that was going on in the beauty world. Meanwhile, a couple of natural hair YouTubers got a hold of that and thought, let's try this in the natural hair world. It's something different, it's creative, and I love the idea. I've never seen anything like this in the natural hair community. Our videos tend to be pretty much the same, wash and goes and twist outs and just the typical things. But sometimes you could take the same of, a, of an idea and you can kind of kick it up a notch and make it more fun and creative. So I thought this was a really great idea to try because this is something, again, that's not seen in the natural hair community right now. And I'm hoping it's a trend that will catch on and other YouTubers, natural hair YouTubers, will start to do the same thing because I would actually love to see more videos like this one. And you know when the trend starts in natural hair community, it takes off. So I'm hoping this is one of them. So oftentimes I kind of get a little bored with some of the content. It's kind of redundant and of course, Everything on YouTube has been done over and over and over and over and over again. It's just very repetitive, but it's the way you can kind of tweak it and make it your own. Well, maybe not so much make it your own, but kind of tweak it and just make it very interesting for your viewers and for your followers. And I thought this was a really great idea and a really great uh, challenge to do. So the gist of this challenge is basically to allow a number picker or a number wheel, something on the internet you can get on your phone. It could be an app that will randomly pick numbers for whatever your products are. So let me give an example. So I have a list of all the products I use for my wash day. Shampoos, conditioners, masks, leave-ins, stylers, my styling tools, um, my hairstyles, all these things that I do for my, my wash day. So instead of me choosing the items I'm going to use for my wash day, I'm going to allow this random wheel or this random numbers picker to pick the items for me. So I have a list of shampoos, I have a list of conditioners, and a list of my stylers and so forth. And so I have them numbered and I'm just going to hit the button, allow the wheel or allow the number picker to pick a number and whatever number that is uh, that corresponds with that shampoo, that's the shampoo that I will use. And the same thing for the conditioners and mask and so forth. So that's pretty much the gist of it. So I have no control over what products I'm gonna use and I'm also gonna mix it up a little bit just to make it a little bit more extra fun and entertaining. So I'm gonna put some products in there that are my least favorite and put some products in there that are my most fave. Just to kind of, like I said, make it fun and interesting. So currently under this bonnet, I have not done my hair. My hair is not clean at all. I just did not want to show it on camera. So this is what I grabbed to put on, on my hair. So I have a list of shampoos, about seven shampoos that I'm going to be choosing from. So let me share with you what those shampoos are. And they will be on the side of the screen on either side of me. So you can also visually see the names of these products as well. So for my shampoos, number one is the Texture ID Curl Clarifying Shampoo. Number two is the Main Choice Slippery When Wet. Number three is the Mayel Organics Rosemary Mint Shampoo. Number four, Natural Club Avocado Shampoo. Number five, Giovanni 5050 Balance Shampoo. Number six is TGIN Miracle Repair RX Shampoo. And last, number seven is the Herbal Essence Detox Black Charcoal Shampoo. So I have seven numbers on my wheel corresponding with the seven shampoos that I have. And we're just going to see which shampoo it chooses. And of course, it ain't making no noise. All right, looks like number three. So number three was the Myel Organics Rosemary Mint Shampoo. So far, so good. So I got a really great shampoo to start out my wash day routine. So I'm glad it selected this one and not one of my least favorite ones. So I did do a video on this one and this is a really, really great shampoo. So I will highly recommend it. So that's what we're going to be using. So starting out really good so far. Okay, so the next thing is to determine if I want to do a mask or just a regular conditioner. So I'm just going to have two selections on the wheel and we'll see which one we'll be going with.
All right, so it looks like we're gonna be going with a mask this time. So now to select which mask we're gonna do. So for my mask, my selections are number one, the raw sugar, all that shines, number two, TGIN Honey Miracle Mask, or number three, Beautiful Mane Sweet Sugar. Okay, so I have three numbers on the wheel, so let's see which hair mask we go with. I was just thinking made some noise. Looks like number three. So number three was Beautiful Mane Sweet Sugar. I have reviewed this product before. It is one that I fell in love with. It's a really, really great hair mask. Black owned company, definitely check out Beautiful Mane. They have some really great products. So, so far, I'm really excited about the products that I'll be using for my wash day so far. So up next will be the leave-ins. Okay, so I have four leave-in choices. My choices include Kinky Curly Not Today is number one. Number two, Natural Club Nourishing Avocado. Number three, As I Am Olive and Tea Tree Oil. And number four, the TGIN Green Tea Super Moist. All right, so here we go. And I think it may make some sounds this time. Well, I guess I lied. Looks like number two. So for my leave-in, we'll be going with number two, which is the Natural Club Nourishing Avocado Leave-In. Okay, so I'm really excited because we are on the right track with a lot of great products for my wash day. So, so far I have not got any products that are my least favorite. So I got a great shampoo, I got a great mask, and now I have a really great leave-in. So now onto my stylers. So for my stylers includes number one, TGIN Honey Curls Custard, number two, the Eco Styler Gel, number three, Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic, Number four, Extreme Wet Line Gel. And number five, the Natural Club Flex Seed Gel Plus Yogurt. And here we go. Does it look like it's gonna tilt on three? Okay, so which one was number three? Number three. Oh, Uncle Funky's daughter, Curly Magic! Yay! be going with Uncle Funky's daughter Curly Magic. This is unbelievable. I am getting the best products for this wash day so far. So about two videos ago I did a video on this styler on this um, curl stimulator Curly Magic curl stimulator and this stuff is absolutely amazing and I said I was gonna leave it and keep it in my natural hair stash and this is just one that I fell in love with and yeah this uh, this is like, this is going to be a great wash day because as long as I got a really good styler, that's just going to really set this whole thing off. So yeah, I'm in love. Woo we're going to have a good wash day. All right, so that's four great products that I got for my wash day so far. So next on the list will be my edge controls. Which edge control will I be using? So I think I have a total of four of those. Yeah, I have a total of four edge controls. So let's see which one I'll be using for this wash day. All right, so my options includes the ORS or ORS olive oil. That's the sweet almond um, edge control, I think it is. Number two, made by beautiful hydrating edge gel. Number three, style factor. And number four from Natural Club, the Flex C gel edge control. like number two okay so what was number two number two was by may beautiful uh hydrating edge gel this is a pretty decent edge gel it's it is very hydrating and i have used this quite a bit in the past it's just been a while since i've used it since i started using the style factor and the um and some others now for this particular edge gel this one is hydrating um it smells really really good it has the most beautiful smell ever but it, it smells so good. It is very hydrating, but it doesn't keep my edges as slick as I would like for them to. Um, it just it kind of it just makes them feel good and it hydrates some and moisturizes my edges and it does leave a little bit of sleekness, but it doesn't last long. So it it'll be okay, I guess. Um mm, yeah, mm, it'll be okay. I still got a pretty decent hair gel, but I would have really loved the style factor better. But this is what it chose, so this is what I'll be going with. 
Okay, so so the next thing will be my styling tools. Which styling tools will I use for my hair? Now for this particular selection, I'm gonna select two only because one styling tool is just not gonna do it for my hair. So I have to have an alternate or backup. So I'm gonna be selecting two styling tools to accomplish whatever style, which is gonna be the next thing that I'll be doing for this wash day. So my options are number one, my fingers, number two, Demon Brush, number three, Tangle Teaser, Number four, the Felicia Leatherwood Detangler, or number five, the Wide Tooth Comb. So again, I'll be selecting two styling tools. So here's number one. So number one will be my fingers that I'll be using for my styling tools, which is gonna be new. For me because I don't typically just use my fingers only really for any styles that I can think of as far as styling my hair so this should be interesting and my second pick oh my goodness okay so I'm using my fingers and I'll be using the Felicia Leatherwood detangler as my second option. I was hoping I could get a wide tooth comb in there somewhere. <laughs> uh, tangle teaser, I was really hoping for those two. But again, this is what is selected. I don't have a choice. Well, technically I do have a choice. But to follow along with the game and to you know, keep in line with the game, I have to go with what is selected. So here's my Felicia Leatherwood detangling brush. And you saw my fingers already. So that's what we'll be using. Okay, next on the list will be my hairstyles. I have my choices include number one, a high puff, number two, a wash and go, number three, a twist out, number four, flat twist, or number five, a mohawk. I'm really hoping for a wash and go with this or a flat twist, but I'm really hoping it turns out to be a wash and go. So it looks like we're going to be going with a flat twist, which is good because I can do a flat twist pretty decent. It's quick and easy and I don't have to do a whole lot, you know, a styling. So that's actually good. So I'm pretty uh, pleased with that. So for my style will be a flat twist. And last on the list will be my hair accessories. Will I be using bobby pins, clips, or beads? Those are my choices. So let's see which one it selects. Okay, number two was beads. Beads? Beads. What am I going to do with flat twist and beads? Wow. So here are my beads that I'll be using. Um, I've used these beads for like boho styles, uh, kind of summer styles. I have not shown you guys any bead hairstyles, which I was eventually, but I guess I'll be doing it in this video. This is gonna be very, very interesting how that turns out. Yeah, that's what I like about this challenge. Like it's fun like that, cause you just don't know. It's, it's like surprises. You know, what products you're going to use, what accessories, you know, it's just surprises, you know, and you have to put it together and create and, and be creative. And this is part of the challenge. So it is what it is. This is where we are. This is what I'll be using. That is everything that I'll be using for this wash day. And we're going to bring it all together. And I'm going to show you guys the final results at the end of this thing. Pray with me. <laughs> Bow your heads that this is going to come out great and be a success. Let's go ahead and dive right on into this thing. So without further ado, let's get started.
I used all the products that were so randomly selected. I was able to complete my style and incorporate the beads, which was a little difficult, but then I pulled it together towards the end. So I got my beads in there. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I hope you enjoyed this particular content on my channel. This random numbers, pick my products, pick my wash day routine, whatever. So the next one I'll probably do is random numbers, pick my wash and go. So I'll probably do that one next. But again, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was fun. It was fun for me. I enjoyed doing it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's just Janine and I will see you on the next one. Bye guys. Oh,